With prizes ranging from $9,000 to $500,000, MS Birkin bags are among the most expensive bags in the world. The luxury bags are indeed the epitome of opulence. Some people even believe investing in a high-end accessory is better than investing in the stock market. Welcome to Lux Life. And when it comes to luxury and lifestyle, we've got you covered. Today, we're going to talk about what makes Birkin handbags so priceless. But before we begin, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. Feel free to click that notification bell to receive updates and be the first to check out our latest videos. Now, let's begin. The history of this luxury bag started with English-French singer and actress Jane Birkin, the bag's namesake. While on a flight from Paris to London, the English actress sat next to John Louis Dumas, the CEO of Hermès. Jane always carried a wicker basket with her, which she used to carry everything she brought, like groceries, diapers, and other stuff. While on the flight, she attempted to fit her basket in the overhead compartment, but the lid accidentally came off. The contents of the bag came out and ended up spilling everywhere. Jane told the person next to her that she had difficulties finding a weekend bag she would like. Damas then said he was the head of Hermes, and the two spent the flight drawing ideas for handbags on the back of an airplane sick bag. Damas presented Jane the Birkin bag a year later. The creation was spacious and had a refined leather design ideal for everyday usage. The Birkin's pockets are handy, and the bag shuts to prevent spills. Hermes manufactures the bags in France, utilizing high-quality materials, including calf skin, alligator skin, and even ostrich skin. The bags are also made by hand, making them even more special. It is quite unique as well, since the bag does not feature a logo and will only be recognized by people who truly know about them. The Birkin is now one of the most expensive and hard-to-get bags, but it wasn't very popular when it first came out. Not until the 1990s did the Birkin become one of the most popular bags. Now, they're the best way to show that you're rich and successful. Singaporean socialite and businesswoman Jamie Chu's collection of more than 200 Birkins is thought to be the largest in the world, and Victoria Beckham's collection of Birkin bags is said to be worth more than $2 million. So what made the Birkin bag super expensive? Well, you can't just walk into a Hermes store and buy one in stock. In fact, there used to be a waiting list for those who wanted to purchase one. But now, the only way to get a Birkin bag is to be important enough or rich enough to afford one. And if you are lucky to buy one, don't expect that you will be able to choose the color or size. The number of Birkin bags a customer can buy from Hermes in a year is limited because the company has implemented restrictions. This way, the bag remains rare and exclusive, and the gap between demand and supply has led to a booming second-hand market. In the last five years, the value of Hermes Birkin bags has climbed to 500% or an increase of 14% every year, according to a 2017 research. One of the most sought-after models from the brand comes from Hermes Himalai Collection. The white Himalayan Birkin bag, sometimes referred to as the holy grail of handbags, includes 18-karat white gold hardware and more than 200 diamonds. This bag is made using exceptionally rare white or albino crocodile skin. The rare expensive skin is delicately dyed to resemble the snowy Himalayan mountains, hence its name. These bags have a high retail and resale value because they are works of art. Artisans who make these bags need to train for so many years before they are even allowed to make a Birkin bag. The bag's high price is also because there aren't many of them around. It is a well-kept secret how many Birkin bags Hermes makes each year, but it is thought that there may be around 200,000 in circulation. And for the luxury resale market, Birkin bags are a hot commodity. Since we're on the topic of luxury items, have you ever purchased a Birkin handbag? Feel free to leave your responses in the comments below. And while you're at it, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Now, back to the video. The Birkin bag keeps its value, and sometimes, it even increases in price. It comes down to the leather. 
color, size, and hardware of the bag. There are so many things that affect how much a Birkin costs that the price can change. But if you buy a Birkin, say in 2004, when the retail price was $5,000, you will probably be able to sell it for $5,000 or $6,000 still, even if it's well used. Even though resellers like the Real Real and Privé Porter have made more Birkins available, the prices haven't decreased. If you've been to our mess, you might not always be able to get the color or size you want, but from these resellers, you can have an option. Even if it costs a little more, customers are still willing to pay. So let's suppose we currently have just one Eton Birkin 35 with gold hardware. The moment it gets sold, they might not have that specific bag for some time. Someone would be willing to spend perhaps an additional $10,000 to acquire it immediately. So if you have the means, you should consider purchasing a Birkin. Be careful of fake bags though. Many of them are circulating all over shopping platforms and even on Canal Street in New York City. It was so rampant that in 2012, Hermes filed a lawsuit against various websites that marketed counterfeit goods and won $100 million in penalties. In the same year, French police broke up a group of criminals making fake Birkin bags. Despite the company's efforts, there are still a lot of fake Birkins in the market of lesser quality. And, no matter how hard they try, fake products still flood the market. Over the years, the quality of counterfeit bags has also improved so much. Now, differentiating the authentic from the fake is becoming a real challenge. But, there are still ways to spot the fake Birkin, because after all, replicating the original is impossible. First, the fake has longer handles, usually longer than the bag itself. The hardware shouldn't be too shiny or stick out. The feet should never screw off too, since they are hit with a hammer. The leather surface should be very soft and supple to the touch. And if the price looks too good to be true, then it probably is. Birkin bags will never go out of style and will stand the test of time. There may be a lot of other luxury bags out there, but the Birkin bag will always be among the most coveted. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the thumbs up button, click subscribe and hit the notification bell to receive updates on our latest videos. Also, feel free to leave us a comment. If you want to watch more videos, head on over to our channel to see more from Lux Live. See you!